I'm Nixie Pixel, and you're watching OS All, your source for open source. What's that one program you can't live without? If you're like me, you access this on all your devices, phone, desktop, computer, laptop, you name it. If you guessed Angry Birds, stay after class. But if your answer was email, you've earned extra credit and are in for a treat with this one. Brought to you by HostGator. We don't often use the full capabilities of software, but Thunderbird is very customizable with the ability to add extensions and change its appearance. I really hate setting up email, but with Thunderbird it's easy. It includes a mail account setup wizard that's really helpful in configuring email. Since it automatically tests standard mail server settings, you don't have to know every single detail. Thunderbird includes a robust tab-based search tool that lets you filter results by criteria such as the to, from field, subject, body, and specific email accounts or folders. Email is automatically indexed, so searches through thousands of messages is lightning fast. It's also really secure with SSL support and other secure connections, as well as the capability of handling encryption and PGP signing. It may feel like your email client is spying on you when Thunderbird does things such as suggest you may be missing a file attachment if you type attach in your message and don't upload a file. It also includes a powerful logging tool which records all activity on both your end and interactions between Thunderbird and your mail server. One of the most exciting things is about how customizable it is. With tens of millions of users choosing from hundreds of different add-ons, including popular ones such as Adblock Plus and different skins to make your interface pretty. Thunderbird also includes a handy junk mail filter that learns from you as you identify spam and junk mail, and it automatically warns you about messages that appear to be scams or links that send you to hidden URLs. And we know how much that sucks. In some cases, we've been building tools that are specific to Linux for the desktop, and they only work on Linux. But I see two major projects that are wildly, wildly successful, Mozilla and OpenOffice, and these two programs are cross-platform. Unless you're using a company's standard email client like Lotus Notes or Outlook, I really can't see any downside to using Thunderbird for your email and news reading needs. This free and open source program does just about everything you want right on installation, and you can add a lot of extensions easily if you find that it's something that's lacking, such as full contact management utility and plugins to Prettyfy Thunderbird. I highly recommend it as an email and news reader. Try out Thunderbird here, it will make you a really hoopy frood. Thanks for watching OS Alt. Be sure to subscribe so you don't miss next Friday's episode of All Things Open Source. It's time for some sponsor love. Seriously though, I've been with HostGator since my first blog post in 2008. With Linux-based servers and plans starting at under four bucks a month, you get 24 seven support and access to tons of website building tools. HostGator has gone green and is 130% powered by wind energy. Did I mention they'll even migrate your current site for free? For OS Alt viewers, HostGator is offering 25% off your order or your first month free. Just go to HostGator.com and enter the code NixieOSAlt at checkout.